It's the first Friday night that bars and restaurants in North Dakota can be open since the middle of March. North Dakota Governor Doug Burgum lifting restrictions that were put in place to protect people from the coronavirus. Although many are staying home, some couldn't wait to get out. Valley News Team's Alexandra Kay joins us from downtown Fargo tonight. Alexandra, is it busy? Mike, I'm outside of the old Broadway here in downtown Fargo. They're one of the businesses that chose to reopen today. And inside are nearly two dozen people enjoying the night. Across the city, parking lots that have been empty for weeks are packed again as the state lifts its restrictions. Bars, restaurants and gyms were given the choice to open up and people were eager to get inside, some coming to their favorite spot right at opening. But this is not all without some change. All of the places I visited today are displaying the guidelines provided by the state, keeping capacity at 50%, spacing out the tables inside, and asking their guests that once they do get inside, to sit down and not move around. Bargoers I spoke with earlier said they understand the gravity of the situation and do not take the freedom lightly. It's up to every individual to allow this to keep going because, you know, if we just abuse it, then we're going to go right back into isolation. It's 50 percent uh, to what they're allowing as far as people in the building. So we knew that it, it would be spread out and, and uh, I mean, been cooped up for a few months. It's just good to get out of the house. It works both ways. We can support a local business. We can we can hang out with our friends and we can also do our part to do our social distancing. So. And one of the things that Governor Doug Burgum asked of those that do choose to go out tonight is that they stay respectful of others and wear a mask. But I have to say I have seen nearly none of the bar goers wearing masks tonight. But the good news is that most of the bar staff were. Mike. All right. Thanks so much.